Dr. William L. Halzimer, Dean and Professor of Nursing at Rutgers University, held a lecture on Perceived AIDS Stigma, a multinational African study, on Thursday, January 19th, in the University Center at Texas A&M University, Corpus Christi. From 1999 to 2003, Holzemer collaborated with nurse faculty members from universities in Botswana, Lesotho, South Africa, and Swaziland on self-care and family care symptom management in the home for people living with HIV AIDS. His work resulted in the development and validation of the symptom management manual, Strategies for People Living with HIV AIDS. Currently, Holzemer is examining the role of stigma and discrimination on quality of life for persons living with HIV AIDS and on quality of work life for nurses caring for AIDS patients in Lesotho, Malawi, South Africa, Swaziland, and Tanzania. Um, people who live with HIV is a chronic illness. They need skilled nurses for their care. How does the symptom management manual help healthcare professionals do that? Colleagues across the world collectively developed an HIV symptom management manual, which is available in 14 different languages to freely download. People living with HIV often do experience different kinds of symptoms. Uh, stomach upset, pain, fatigue, neuropathy, different problems. The manual helps you develop self-care strategies on how to improve and manage the quality of your life. Um. How has the perception of someone who is infected with HIV changed in the last 10 to 15 years? I think mostly for most people they are coming to understand the fear of contagion isn't what we thought it was 25 years ago and it's a very very low risk of becoming HIV infected. It's a risk but it's a very low risk. Today's lecture is pretty important for the nursing students here. How does something like this help your nursing students prepare to give quality care to patients with HIV? I think the more that you know about a topic, the more that you're not frightened of it and because of the stigma that's attached and the feeling that even just simply touching somebody with HIV can convey the disease to you, I think that part will be very, very important for the students because in the long run, many of us know people that are infected with HIV and we simply, they're, they're just not made known to us and everything, but the more a student knows or the more a nurse knows about a disease, the less fearful they are in caring for that patient.